Miles One News, Daytime Edition. The Mount Vernon West train station is getting a huge makeover. This after the stop on the Metro North Harlem line was purchased by a developer for $3 million. Finals One's Kelsey Perkins has the story. Many call it dilapidated. There are cracks and stains on the walls, outdated architecture, and... The elevator smell like pee. Businesses deserted and shut down. The only thing left standing is the Chase Bank. It's, it's pretty bad. Need some activity, you know? This hallway here at the Mount Vernon West train station doesn't serve much purpose other than, well, being a hallway. Developers hope to change that by bringing in restaurants and businesses. The McQuestin Company is a developer that has built many projects in the same area, has purchased the train station for $3 million. We see tremendous potential for additional ridership. We see tr tremendous potential for additional uses here that are conducive to commuters, such as cafes and coffee shops and dry cleaners, maybe even a Starbucks. Sometimes you get up early out your bed going to work, you don't have any time to make tea or grab a snack. Yeah, that would be nice. From the 15,000 square foot station to Midtown Manhattan, it's the shortest commute into the city in Westchester. Joseph Apicella with the McQuestin Company says the city is in the process of rezoning the entire area, allowing for mixed use development, residential and commercial. With our engineers and our architects, we'll make a determination as to whether or not we will raise the building and build new or preserve some elements of the building as part of our new building or do it just a gut renovation. Apicella says they hope to begin building in the early months of 2017. This is something that the people of Mount Vernon should be excited about because they're going to see a transformed train station experience and commutation to Manhattan that they haven't seen before. In Mount Vernon, Kelsey Perkins, Fios, One News.